Hey, good morning everybody. This is John again from Volkswagen Planet. And today we are going to be working on part 9A as an apple, which is going to be fuse number 5 in our ongoing series of rewiring our 1972 Super Beetle. And uh, I want to thank you guys for joining us along, staying with us, and even maybe even learning something. So like, comment, subscribe, thumbs up, thumbs down, or don't. But um, let's see what we're going to be working with today. This is going. To, this should be a pretty quick video. Uh, again, we're, we're, we'll, we will be working on the fifth fuse. So this right here will be the literally the first fuse. If you're looking at it from the driver's side door, we're working our way towards the passenger side. So we will be working on this fuse right here today. Now. Just to, uh, usually we talk about what comes into the fuse and what goes out. So today there's nothing going into the fuse, which would be a wire that would be from the windshield towards the uh, front bumper. So there's nothing to deal with that today. So we see a white fuse, which is going to be 8 amp. So we have two wires coming out the back. So let's see what this has to deal with today. Now, the... Um, this is going to be uh, actually a completion of the headlight, the uh, left front headlight. <clears throat> so let me show you where or how this wire runs first, and I'll go in depth and explain what I was talking about completing the, um, the headlight here. So it's going to come back out. It's going to come out of the rear of the fuse. So we'll follow this down. This is going to be a... Oops, let me, let me put the little magnifying glass on a wire here so we can uh, trace it down here. This is going to be an all solid wire, guys. Um, we're going to look at a 2.5 millimeter. If you look down, um, I've got a box that does a conversion for you guys. It's always there in every single video. So in case you forget something, you can always check back for reference. But 2.5 millimeter, <clears throat> excuse me is a 14 gauge wire in case you had to replace it you know in case your wire just can't be used no more and you couldn't find a factory color wire so but this case it's it's a simple white wire 2.5 14 gauge so let's let's see how this wire actually runs here so this wire um oops let me put the cursor back on the little wire here so like like i was saying this wire is going to run straight up into the left front headlight But this is where I wanted to explain. See where it says 56A? This is the wire that we're currently working on here on Fuse 5. Now, if you remember and have followed in the past videos, 56B was in uh, Fuse number 3. So let's back this up and we'll show you uh, how these, these wires actually um, are. Basically, you guys can start understanding the way in behind Volkswagen's thinking here. So we're going to back this wire up because we know that it goes from fuse 5 to the left front headlight, just like fuse 3 did on the, on the yellow wire. Now, this is the wire right here that we're, that we're talking about the 56B, the yellow one. But So we're going to put the cursor here because we're going to follow it right back to the fuse box. You know it's the same thickness, 2.5 millimeter, which is the 14 gauge. So we're going to back it up here and we're going to go straight up and it goes right into the fuse five. Now, if we go back over here to three and I don't want to confuse you guys, but I'm just doing this to show you that it does complete this, this, um, the left front headlight here. So hopefully this, you start to understand, you know, and make this is not so intimidating as it has been, you know, before we've gotten to the series. And there's 56B. But let's get back to what we're talking about here. So, so these wires here, these wires are going to come out behind the headlight. They're going to come into the trunk area or the hood by the spare tire. There's going to be two uh, wiring looms or harnesses, depending on what terminology you want, you want to use. It's going to come out of the headlight area. It's going to go Basically, it's going to ride on top of the spare tire area, and it's going to go up. This harness is going to go up and come right below the master cylinder reservoir, 
and that'll be right about this area and it just simply it's a solid white wire and that wire connects um, right back the 14 gauge wire will run right into fuse number five so let's take a break here for a second guys <clears throat> and we'll uh, discuss that uh, blue and white wire all right guys we're back I just want to say um, sorry for my voice being all you know coughing on you and everything else but I'm just got a really bad sinus headaches but I still want to um, grind through these videos because they are important so we're getting back to uh, fuse number five this is going to be part 9a as we uh, have established in the past <clears throat> excuse me nine or <clears throat> a is the classroom which is going to be the wiring diagrams like this and B will actually be the on car so don't forget to check out the videos or if you guys get confused again that's basically what I'm doing I'm dividing it up as one video on the wiring harness or on the uh, the wiring diagram and the other video actual hands-on in the car so again this is fuse number five <clears throat> excuse me it's an eight amp we know where the white wire goes to the headlight now we got a little bit of um, this little squiggly little line here. Now, let me check the, uh, or here. So this wire here actually goes to, this is going to be a solid blue wire with white stripes. Now it could vary depending on the make and model of your car. So don't, don't hold that true to be 100%. But for the Super Beetle, it's a, it's a blue wire with a white stripe or yeah, with a white stripe on there it could be faded so take a magnifying glass and really look at the uh, casings if you want to make sure it's the proper wire so this wire like i said is going to come off and this is going to be the high beam warning light which is going to be on the back of your speedometer so we're going to trace this wire down now uh, let me get to the speedometer here and i'm, I'm going to show you guys something that if you, if you see a bunch of wires laying around or don't know what okay now 0 0.05 is a 22 gauge wire looking at the charts below the, the conversion 0 0.5 millimeters is a um, what I just got done saying 22 gauge sorry about that so we follow this over and this is going to plug right into the light and this will be your high beam your high beam uh, warning light on it's it's just a little dot I'm sure you guys are familiar with your speedometer if not check it out pull back the um, the high beam lever and this little light should kick on it, sh it should be a blue light like that and um, again it's really that basic that simple now what I was gonna say about these lights is on what I've noticed on the Super Beetle on this on my 72 a lot of the wires, a lot of the, the uh, lights are the blue and white like this. You can see there's another one. Now, this is showing different colors, but on my car, I'm pretty sure it's all the same uh, tint and hue and everything else. So don't let that be a distraction. So we're going to follow this back up again. <clears throat> there's going to be two clips on the back of this, um, this fuse here. So one wire. Now, this is something else I want to talk about. You see how this wire comes off? Now, on some some parts of the Super Beetle, and I'm not sure exactly 100%, and I can't answer this 100% uh, honestly with you, but on this particular situation, there's one clip that goes on, it slides on it, and it, the one turns into a two. So that's how this hooks up here. This wires are not connected to each other, but in this situation, this this wire is connected on a two-prong, that connects into the one prong that goes right there. So I hope that's not too confusing, but these wires are separate in this situation. Now there is wires in the future where they are clamped together. So just to do a quick recap, we know this wire here goes to the headlights, which completes the left front headlight. Let me scroll down real quick just to we know it's a 14 gauge wire and we've talked about where this picks up this also yellow wire and completes the whole entire left front headlight. 
like that, the 56A and the 56B location. So that was what the main wires connect to, and that's going to be in Fuse 3 and in Fuse 5, which we're talking about right now. So if you want to check back in Video 3, or Fuse 3, you can um, see where we talk about that. And the second part of this video is we're going to talk about the high beam warning light, which is going to be your blue wire with a white stripe. It's going to come off the back again. And it's going to follow, it's, uh, this is a really small wire, guys. I mean, we're talking about maybe, this, this wire is maybe a foot long tops. Really thin, 22 gauge. And, um, like I said, it's just going to plug into the, the, uh, very bottom of your speedometer. It's going to be a blue light. And what it does is it, it, it tells you that your high beams are on. Real plain and simple. Real quick, that should complete our fuse for today. Hope that um, this guy, this videos are helping you. If uh, if they are helping you, or if you if I'm not explaining something 100% or something that could be explained a little better, drop a comment below. Don't be you know as long as it's, you're not being um, just just be respectful. I could take criticism. You know I'm here to help everybody. I may say something that may confuse you. So put a comment below. Just tell me, hey, how, <clears throat> how you're doing or how I'm doing. If there's something I can do better to help you guys out, let me know. Maybe a different term to use, something that I'm not um, explaining to you properly. But <clears throat> like I said, say whatever you want to, whether it's negative or positive, just be respectful. That's all I ask. So like, comment, subscribe, thumbs up, thumbs down. Don't comment. Not a problem. No hard feelings. So as all, like we always say in all of our videos, God bless you. God bless your family. God bless our great nation. It's our country's birthday today. I'm doing this on the 4th of July video or the 4th of July guys. So go, go out and have a great time. Just be safe because we want to see you here on the next video. And as always guys, uh, we'll catch you on the next video and thanks for watching.